hello 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 welcome back guys to my youtube channel if you are seeing this scene a screen then you know which series we're gonna talk about yes we're gonna talk about our summer semester preparation video but here i'm not doing today a requirement analysis video but i i came up with the application video because i was go just going through the excel sheet that we had made and we are already in october and i had a sense that there were some colleges that uh, were starting in october for summer semester 2025 that's the reason i just gone through the excel sheet and there were uh, one college that we did it on the third list which was university of rostock so today i will be showing how to apply for university of rostock for the course computational science and engineering this computational science and engineering can be applied for two major things one is from mechanical and from electrical i will show you for electrical point of view so people who are using who want to apply for the same course with the perspective of mechanical then please just go through the same video see the step and apply that's it because it's a uni assist process the steps will be same and identical so no need to worry before to, uh, getting into today's video i wanted to ask you guys if you are new to this channel then don't forget to like share and subscribe and also please share this video to the people who are in need so that they will also get to know how to apply and they can start their masters in germany when we have this excel sheet that we are preparing so as you know we have already done two colleges in first and second third it is starting on first december and like that when i was going through this was the sixth college that we did and we had a list saying that university of rostock for the computational science and engineering and the application dead starts is october 1st and deadline is 30th november so i am doing this video on today so it will be out on monday which is tomorrow and you have ample amount of time to apply also so please make sure you watch this video until the end the two parts and you can apply and 30th november is the deadline so you are well inside the deadline to apply so without any due we'll get started now now we will just jump into our dad website of master degree computational uh, science and engineering where we also saw this comp computational science and engineering csc will be also given from electrical point of view and also mechanical point of view they have two specialization people who have done electrical engineering also can apply and also people who have done mechanical engineering can also apply and there is a different section also because i also saw already in uni assist how it looks like that's the reason i'm saying but once i take you to the uni assist uni assist website then you guys also see it but first we'll jump into university of rostock official website and just look a uh, look into what are the documents that we need to do the requirement analysis we have already done but what are the documents that we have to be sure that we will just jump into it we can quickly click into international and degree studies and here in degree studies we have the first one computational science and engineering and yes i know there are courses compu uh, computer science and electrical engineering and these two courses also it's open if you want a video separate please make sure you comment it out i will make a video but not regularly after this because it will be same video so that's the reason maybe i will do it after two weeks but if you guys need it early then please comment it out for computation uh, computer science and electrical engineering now we will go into computational science and engineering here as we know content and objective study material career perspective and what are the things what course offers everything we have done or a detailed description or detailed analysis as a requirement analysis you can just go into our dad playlist where you can find this video on the sixth number or episode six now here we can click on application and admission admission requirements we just quickly go through it this also i have explained in deeper in the requirement analysis here we just have to have a electrical engineering degree or compu computational science engineering degree information technology mechanical engineering physics at least with 180 credit points you need to have and you need to have at least 85 for 85% of your cgpa so it should be like 85% uh, which is more if you don't have it then they uh, you can also compensate with the gate exam so it is not mandatory that you have to show gate because there was a comment i saw it is mandatory no it is or so they are asking or so you need to have a 180 180 credit points degree which is basic every people will have it people who have done 3 years of degree also will be eligible for it and you need to have a good grade which will be 2.3 uh, and below then native uh, if you are not a native english speaker then you need to have a uh, IELTS score of 6.5 not older than 2 years this is for sure and a solid skill in programming language c c++ java python and any of this not everything but you need to have any of it okay then you need to have a solid knowledge in mathematics all these things these things in an engineering degree everything will be uh, completed so no need to worry about these particular proof of uh, profound knowledge and all but they need a proof of 
knowledge certificate or any of the document so here as i told you here this particular thing can only be proved by your module handbook i have made a video how to get a ha module handbook please check out any of my dad website as soon as i see which video i will comment it on or pin in the comment in that video you will know how to find a module handbook or how the module handbook will look like so that you guys can also get it then you can click on international perspective student that is us then international perspective students must be in the period of 1st april to 31st may for the next winter term so we are applying for summer summer term so we will go here from 1st october to 30th november for next summer semester so this is the timeline that we are using or we are supposed to apply for this particular college and we are inside this application deadline that's the reason we are applying today or showing you how to apply then and enroll the degree program in uh, university of rostock and what are the application how to do it master course and international courses they are they have it but we know most of the information because you guys are following me i know most of the information so i will let you know how to apply so here we can directly click into apply online at uni assist as soon as you clicked on apply uni uh, apply uh, apply in uni assist it will it took us to this search result that we always see this screen here usually the best things to do is just search for rostock then you will see a university of rostock after that the graduation that we are looking for is master as soon as you clicked on search and we are searching for summer semester 2025 you can see computational science engineering with a specialization mechanical engineering if you want to pursue towards mechanical engineering and computational science engineering if you want to specialize in electrical engineering that is what i am showing how to apply if for me if you ask it's waste of time making a two video for two different things because electrical engineering and mechanical engineering if you are applying through uniss no none of the documents will change only document will change is your degree certificate name where uh, some people would have been done electrical engineering he will have a electrical engineering degree a people who have done mechanical engineering he will have a mechanical engineering degree and you have to give your supporting documents that's it other than that there won't be any fancy things that it would be different as a uniss website okay but if if you still need a video then please comment it down then i will show you how to apply and here the main thing that i wanted to tell you is it's an approval type nc fry and here also i also saw here the approval type is nc fry and you can see here admission restriction there is no admission re restriction without nc or nc fry this means people who all go into or people who have all kind of admission requirement that they are asking if say example 100 people goes through this admission requirement they need to take 100 people depending on the, the requirement uh, criteria that they have say example if 30 people all together has this application uh, admission requirement they will take 30 people if 120 people have this admission requirement then they will take all 120 people who are passing this admission requirement that is what nc fry means so please make sure uh, it is easy that you will have a better chance because it's a NC fry where you don't need to have a competition people when you have a re same requirement then you need to go through some sort of again grading analysis where they will take only people who has more grade so this is not that type of college then what we will do we will just click on choose as, as soon as you clicked on choose we need to log in and people if you are new to this channel if you don't know how to create an account we have made a dedicated uni assist or uh, uni uni assist and my assist setting up a video please go and check out that three series of video and you will understand everything each and everything of uni assist if you also here you want to just click on and create an account you can click on register and fill this mandatory details then your account will be ready but now we have already made an account so i will quickly type the account information then i will log in now i have filled all my login details then i can click on login as soon as i clicked on login we have same search result but we already showed you or uh, i already showed you how to search though i will quickly search and i will add it to the cart 